Hi guys, welcome back. Here we are to learn how to download Python and install it for the first time. Of course, for different microcontrollers, you may already have Python pre-installed. But for practice, you can start with on your computer itself just to learn Python. For the first few lectures, we'll be learning how to use Python, how to start with the basics of Python, and then go on to interface with IoT. All right, now, how do we start the installation process? Go on to your browser and just you can just write Python. You can go to this particular website called as python.org, python.org. Over here, you have downloads. In downloads for Windows, you have something like Python. You can download the latest version for Windows, download Python 3.6.2. You can just click on it and just start, you know, after it does the download. You go and you have a few more documentation which is given for Linux and or Mac OS too. You can just go to that if you want Linux. You can just go to that and you can understand how this is done. And they have given you they have given you detailed documentation for the same. Say for example, you can just you can just download the latest Python 3 release. And once you download the Python 3 release, you can over there you have you know something called as a README and you can just start off with it. It's not a it's not much of a deal in Python 3.6.2 the moment for Windows if you download Python 3.6.2 you get something like this on your on your desktop where this is your exe file when you click on the same it tells you okay you can say run when you run you can say there will be an option for you if you're installing for the first time it says install and you can start with the installation allow the setup for a particular for a couple of times and once you're done with that Python 3.6.2 is installed. It doesn't take much of an effort to install it on Windows. This is about the installation of Python. Coming on to, you know, of course I'm cancelling it out because it says if do I want to modify, repair or uninstall, which I do not want to do. Okay, and then how do I start off with Python? Okay, how do I start off with Python once once I have my Python installed? How do I start off with it? Maybe you can just search for something on your computer it, you can just write something called as an IDLE an IDLE is the Python GUI that you can use for for programming so here you have the Python GUI that is called as idle you can start programming over here in Python it's as simple as that okay with this we'll start with the programming from the next from the next video on